Hello, viewers, and welcome back to another edition of The Moya Show. In today's episode, a man is trying to prove that his dad is really, in fact, his dad. Now, let's listen to Ebenezer's story, shall we? My name is Ebenezer, and I am 30 years old. This man is my father. I have always known that he is my father. I mean, look at the resemblance. I mean, I even traveled all the way to the States from Ghana, and this man came and told me to my face, I am not your father. Go and find your father kept on disrespecting me but today today i will prove that he is my real father i will prove by force everyone welcome ebenezer <laughs> now ebenezer you're saying that your dad won't claim you as his son yes <laughs> it has been very hard for me Aww. <laughs> <laughs> All you have to do is cry, show tears, and these wise people, they will show you sympathy anyhow. <laughs> you saw how they did that, 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 oh. <laughs> wow, that is terrible. But there's always two sides to a story. Now let's listen to what Mr. Kanadu has to say. How can I be his father? It's impossible. I mean, first of all, that boy is a very ugly person. I mean, I don't make ugly people. Me, I'm not ugly, I'm sexy. Two, when I was back in Ghana, I only had one woman. And that is my lovely wife, okay? And I only have one child, and that is my son, Yao. And I will prove to everybody that I'm not the father of that useless guy. Everyone, let's now welcome Mr. Kanadu. So I see you brought your whole family with you. Yes. I wanted to show everybody and prove to everybody that family is the number one most important thing to me. Yes. You know, God doesn't like lying. You said, and I quote, if you don't go with me, God will punish you. Please, I came here to clear all the allegations against my name. That man right there is not my son. He just wants to chop my money. It's a lie. How much money do they think this nigga has? We live in an apartment. I knew you would try to accuse me of money grabbing because that's what you witches do. So that's why I brought my mother. Mama, calm down. That was supposed to be my line. What's all this money grabbing talk? You are the boy's father. Now claim him. Mori, this woman is a witch. She's even a wizard. She's trying to destroy my family. That is an outlandish claim, Mr. Kanadu. But I'm interested to hear what Wendy has to say. Wendy, go ahead. Thank you, Mr. Mori. If Kofi won't say it, me, I will say it. We used to date back in the day, and we were even supposed to get married. Hey! Yes! I love you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this woman has gone mad. What do you mean you love me? What the heck? Ah, so you don't love me back? I mean, love is a very strong word. <laughs> love who? The only thing on this earth that I love more than myself is Big Biash, does it? What is that supposed to mean? Hey, time is going by. <laughs> I have to go to the market. <laughs> you don't even have a watch. What time are you checking? I'm going now. Bye-bye. Excuse me. Hey, Nyash is shaking. Madam, please. And after that, I never saw him again until I came to America. Mr. Kanadu, what do you have to say for yourself? I can say that this woman right here is a very talented liar. My mother is not a liar. Huh? Fatherless boy, shut up. I personally wouldn't take that type of disrespect, but that's just me though. Yes, back in the day, we used to date. It's true. But there's a reason why we are not together today. Reason one, you smell like tilapia. Why are you having conflict with your bathtub? It's not nice. Bath yourself. Wow. Reason two, you cannot cook. Mori, every time this woman entered the kitchen, I will even say a prayer. Every time I eat this woman's food, I had to shit. Very bad shits, very painful shits. Why? Ah, dang. Hmm. And the last and most important reason, you are useless. I mean, the whole time I've been knowing you, you have been jobless. Are you not ashamed of your income? Are you not embarrassed? All your mates, they are having employment, having big money, nice money. And, and where is your own? Where is your portion? You won't go and look for, for, for work. All you do is gossip. You are doing all this talking, talking, talking. But you still cannot prove why you are not the father. Mm -hmm. I mean, look at this. Am I the only one who is saying this? You're not the only one. Can you shut up? Well, that's enough talking because I've got the DNA results right here. In the case 
of 30-year-old Ebenezer, Mr. Kanadu. You are not the father. Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have disgraced myself on national television. Hey! I mean, I knew that old ass nigga wasn't my brother anyway. I mean, he's an uncle. Mr. Kanadu, what do you have to say to the people? My enemies will never win. Any bad wishes upon me, any bad prayers, back to sender, back to sender, back to sender.